Yeah, I I hate the kelp forest, honestly. Everyone hates kelp forest. I think, yeah, we all do a little bit. God help us, everyone. Jeez, it takes 60 to get to Flying Dutchman. Well, I also have the Patrick socks. True. Which we should probably cash in at some point. Yeah, I should probably do that, honestly. In fact, let's get out of here and go do the socks. We'll do that in, like, we'll do that after, we'll get one more golden spatula here so we have, like, a place to save, I guess. I guess, yeah. It's funny how Flying Dutchman is like the one character they never ruined. Like, no matter what season he was in, he was always a highlight. Flying Dutchman? Yeah. You know, he's also the voice of Captain Knuckles. Really? Actually, yep. you know what? No, I can hear it. <laughs> like how he answers. Yep. I just like the fact that the Flying Dutchman can grant wishes and that's never brought up again. Yep. I guess he can't, but he can also grant wishes to himself. Yeah. True enough. I guess, I guess what happened, I guess given what happened in two of the endings, they don't want to risk it happening again. Oh yeah, what happened in two of the endings? He ate them. But he didn't, he did that in all the endings, didn't he? Well, yeah, but in the third, in the final ending, it was implied that he was going to eat them. Ah. Uh. Where in the other two was confirmed. Huh. I do, I gotta admit though, I do like this song. Yeah, it's a cool song. Or maybe, or maybe it's just for the Flying Dutch, we can only grant three wishes, period. Like, I can never do that again. Well then, why did he offer four? <laughs> Make it five, four, three, take it or leave it. Uh, <laughs> yep, he still has one list left if that's the case. Oh, God. I love SpongeBob. We all do. What the heck are you showing me? There's a golden spatula there. Be nice if you could reach it, eh? Would be nice, yeah. What is. She's gonna show yep. me the cutscene again? Yeah. He's just going to show me the exact same cutscene again, I guess. Why do we open these clam shells? Does, does nothing but take our money. I have no idea. Wait, no! I didn't want to do that! Ah! These clam shells are, uh, are like insurance. They do absolutely nothing except take our money. Yeah. And, well, actually, no, they're not like insurance. Because insurance, you don't have the option to say no to. Fair enough. Especially in my state, where it's illegal to not have life insurance. For some stupid-ass reason. Yeah, I, I, you know, I don't get it. Yeah, insurance companies, how much you been slipping the government? Probably all of the money. That's probably how insurance would start. It's the freaking Ryan George give you like, hey, I'm profiting off of your anxiety. I'm also profiting off the government forcing you to get this stuff. Yep. I'm doing this th new thing I decided. <laughs> You know, I honestly, you know, it's the sad thing too. A lot of people probably could honestly make money off of other people if they wanted to be dishonest, like most, like most companies are. Yeah. But they don't. They don't do that. Because we're not terrible people most of the time. Most of the time, anyway. Humanity generally doesn't suck. Yeah. With the exception of a very few number of select people that really should not be on the face of this planet. <laughs> yeah, right. If you could just undo those people, the world would be a better place. Assuming we live in a simulation, which yeah. we probably don't. I, I remember that freaking video you sent me about the freaking atheist versus god believer, and it's like how we're all in a simulation. It just goes higher and oh, yeah, higher yeah. and higher. And the yeah, yeah, yeah. Atheists after, yeah. Atheists or, yeah, and Christians after finding out we all live in a simulation. And the Christian's like, like we said, there is a creator. <laughs> the, the, <laughs> the final boss is Andrew Tate. It's like, of course, of course it is. 
Yep. <laughs> Uh, I just love how it just keeps going deeper. There is no lower. It just goes higher and higher. Oh, oh come on! No. Really? Mouse. Are you kidding? What is stopping that? The goop. Okay. I hate these things. Ace, just walk away and come back. There you go, you're dead. And then he just spawns back in like his mod didn't load out. Oh right, I forgot to un I forgot to kill the spawner. Oh piss off, you little shit. Oh piss off, you bloomin' pinwheel. Bloomin pin dead. Oh piss off, you bloomin' pinwheel. <laughs> now do it again. All of it. All of it all over again. Take Hooray. two action. Yeah, you're wondering why I kind of hate these levels? No, I'm not. That's why. Yeah. Well, I'm going to tell you anyway. It's because of these spots. Better or worse than Curse of the Flying Dutchman? That Spongebob game. Uh, I actually didn't really mind Curse of the Flying Dutchman, but I also never played his completion, so... Neither did I. I'm both. Yeah. Did anybody actually finish that game? Probably not, except maybe the completionist. Yeah, completionists would. My, I I still love the details to how the game got made. It's just like, how did this game get approved in the first place? Well, you see, the developer actually had the stuff, so it's like everyone else had bower seats. We had a finished product, so it's like, well, yeah, of course they went for them then. Yeah. Everyone else had bower seats. We had a playable level. That makes sense. I go with them too. Yeah. It's like, what would you rather have? A half of a hamburger or a finished cheeseburger? A finished cheeseburger, but unfortunately, you, you, uh, <laughs> it's a nasty patty. Yeah. This time you're dead. No. Nope. Are you kidding me? No, stay on that lower level so that they can't reach you and then launch the missile. That's a good idea. Launch the missiles. And then they still hit you. At least I'm good enough with these kinds of puzzles to figure out exactly where I need to go. Yeah, they're kind of fun. Timber! Is that a golden spatula down there? I don't know. Yes, it is. Probably best to not go after it, considering you probably won't be able to reach it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, cool, I can get the other one over here. Oh, what? That's a slide? Oh, man. man! Fuck you! <laughs> That's such a dick move. <laughs> at least you respawned right there. Yeah, at least there was a checkpoint there. They knew that was going to happen. And, and, and then that mass thing is also a slide. <laughs> yeah. All right, I think I'm going to try heading back to Bikini Bottom, because, like, Trading there is shots. just a slight possibility that I might have enough to just get into the final boss already. You have more spot socks than spatulas. Now where is Patrick? Okay, just grab my ball. Grab my ball. Grab my ball. Grab my ball and go home. Alright, yeah, I definitely have enough to get two from him. Cool. We got two from Mr. Krabs. Wait, so we just need three for Patrick. Or two. No, we need we need two from Patrick. I thought we need 70 in order to get to the final level. We do need 7, but I know where to get a secret one. Oh, okay. I don't, I don't speak Italian. I don't speak Italian. Wait, do I have enough? I have 5. Shit. Well, let's get that secret one. That's it, still not going to be enough. No, but we can maybe do a little grinding and get to 3500 to get another from Mr. Krabs. 
Nah, that'll take longer than actually just finding another golden spatula. Let's just go back to the Flying Dutchman ship. Is there any other level that we've gone to that we don't have a spatula from yet? Have we mm -hmm. already done? Is there, there any level that we've already done that we don't have a spatula from yet? That's a good point. Let me see. Got that one. Oh, wow. There's a lot from Goo Lagoon that I missed. Hmm. <gasps> oh, oh, I forgot to grab the one from Mr. Krabs. Well, let's go get it then. That'll be you're good. All right. Nice. 69. Nice. nice. If one of the meme had been invented, then the riser would have taken 69 spatulas in order to get to the final level. <laughs> uh oh. What? Someone's texting me, of course. But anyways, uh, we'll we'll get to that later. But now you get the just... secret spatula. Oh boy. Oh my gosh! What? I'm getting a text from us from a okay someone I'm related to who's yeah okay let's just say it's not exactly helpful information basically I'm being told that okay let me just say this uh, my per, a person that I know is telling me that the reason for my current landlord issues are because of my video gaming like what, what the actual f are what? you even on about what the heck how is that even related? It's cause you on that damn phone. It, it's not, yeah, it sounds like one of those. I'm in trouble with the job. I'm in trouble with them because I play video games. What? Yeah, I like logic. I like logic. Wait, hold on. Maybe if I get up here. Oh. Nice. Now I got the 70, oh. but it takes 75 to get in the chum bucket. It does? No! <laughs> okay, well, let's go. Uh... Yeah, you missed two. Do you want to just call it here? All right, we can call it there, then. Got the 70, that's good. Yeah, let's let's just call it there. It's a good spot to end, right? All right, yep. Well, thank you all for watching, and you have all been a stimulated. Yep. Now go away. <laughs>